The story of what happened to Aaron Valenti is one of the most chilling and mysterious stories to date. In early October of 2019, Aaron Valenti, the CEO of a tech company, went to California for a business trip. Now, she was only supposed to be there for a three-day workshop and a tech conference, but on the last day of the trip, literally while she was on her way to the airport to go home, she called her parents frantically and said, quote, it's all a game, it's a thought experiment, we're in the matrix. Those were the last known words that she said before going missing for a few days and then being found dead in a rental car on a residential street. The family strongly believes that this was not a suicide and the company that she owned endorsed research into neural control and brain machine interface technology. Do you think she might have found something out that she wasn't supposed to? Tonight, a police source confirms the body of a tech CEO who went missing on Monday has been found. The 33-year-old was found in the Almaden area in a neighborhood between Camden Avenue and the Almaden Golf and Country Club. KPX finds Maria Medina is in San Jose with the latest developments on the tech executive's disappearance. After several frantic days of searching for Aaron Valenti, a source tells me it was a family friend who found her body in the San Jose neighborhood inside the car she was last seen in. The search ending with some answers, but also grief and heartache for those who knew the tech CEO. I'm very shocked and, and I feel so sorry for the family. Nearly a week after Aaron Valenti went missing. And they've all been looking for her. The search came to an end in the South San Jose neighborhood. A source tells KPIX 5, a family friend found Valenti's rental car. Then their worst fears. Valenti's body was inside. I saw the car there, but I didn't. Never dawned on me somebody was in there. Valenti, the CEO of Utah based tech company Tinker Ventures, was on a business trip in Silicon Valley. Her family last heard from her Monday night as she drove through San Jose instead of heading to the airport to head back to Utah. In a Facebook post, they said she was confusing and disjointed. Her husband posted that her disappearance was extremely out of character. Friends knew something was wrong when she didn't show up for the annual Woman in Tech Awards in Salt Lake, where she was announced the winner. The Entrepreneurship Excellence Award to Erin Valenti, founder and CEO of Tinker Ventures. We've lost one of our own, I think is what feels so strange about this. Valenti's friend says the 33-year-old was a standout in the tech community. And I mean, people like her don't come around very often. Tonight, her family and friends, obviously distraught, did not want to talk. It's horrible. As the search for Valenti ends, but the questions surrounding her death continue. And what a shock. What a shock. But I'm glad that they found her because they've been looking for her for three days. And crime scene investigators arrived on scene here late tonight. There's still no word on the cause of death. In San Jose, Maria Medina, KPIX 5.